All right, what the f is up, YouTube? Welcome to my laboratory. And today's objective is to get the spindles painted, but I've recently been informed that these are not called spindles. They're actually called knuckles. And without getting into too much detail, spindles are stationary. With all that being said, let's get started. All right, I got everything cleaned up and sandblasted now. Thanks to Corey for helping me out and uh, Jeff for letting me use the sandblaster over there. I'm gonna go to the same paint store that I got the paint mix for the engine bay. I'm gonna take one of the calipers with me. I'm gonna paint them red just like that and try to get the paint match for those. I got the forks here too. I'm probably gonna paint them red. This place is local here in Glendale, Arizona. I come here for all my paint needs. Uh, a bunch of nice girls work here. I trust anything they tell me when it comes to paint. They suggested we go out in the sun to match the paint to the calipers here. All right, 50 bucks later, and we got some paint and some primer to match. What we got here, uh, the paint is just the red. You saw the lady matching it up. Uh, they get their paint and mix it up and put it in an aerosol can for you. We'll see how good it looks when it's all done. This is extra paint they just give you because they can't throw paint away. And yeah, uh, this is a primer. Never used it before, but says it goes good on metal parts. This is what they recommended. I'm not a painter. I'm not good at painting, so we're gonna see how this turns out. Uh, I got some alcohol here. I like to. Uh, wipe alcohol on stuff and get all the oil off before I paint it, let it dry real quick. Yeah, now that I got everything taped up, I'm going to try to find a spot to paint these. Um, last time I painted in my garage, I got a lot of overspray on the Honda, so I don't want to do that again. So I'm going to try to find a good spot to paint. <music>
Well, I think they came out all right. I wouldn't recommend painting on the crate. A lot of the paint was rubbing off. Uh, the spray can was angled kind of wrong. It really sucked spraying it. I had to turn the can at an angle, but the paint went on nice. It looks like it was a decent color. We'll see what it looks like when it dries. Yeah, the spray pattern was coming out uh, vertical. I would have liked it to have been horizontal. The one can was enough to spray everything here. I still got some primer left. That was a pretty big can. Probably not a good idea to paint in the sun, but we'll see how it comes out. All right, you remember from the last video, this hub here had the bearing race stuck on it. Uh, I think I got a plan to get it off here now. about it for this video thanks for watching uh, next video here I'm gonna get the bearing and the ball joints installed so make sure you subscribe